All right, and here we go. A little bit of a segmented run. That's all right. Have to go back to Matoya's cave and then that grotto looking fucking castle. And damn, I don't remember anything what I'm supposed to be doing. It's been a while since I've played this. Boy. Hmm. Well, oh, shit. <laughs> just jump right in then. Alright. I know that I can just keep attacking and stuff. Okay. <laughs> That's only... Oh, it is all. Cool. I forgot. Man, it has been a while since I've played this. It's been... Actually, yeah, it's been two weeks since I've played this game. Fuck. That's alright. Got a very odd recording schedule. That's all right. <laughs> Michael Bay explosion, death. <laughs> Red gun, oh boy, this clown ass. Uh, oh, there, yes. Okay. <laughs> La di da. <laughs> I was like, oh, by the way, it's my birthday, so uh, it's my birthday. My bu 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 birthday Little cartman for you. Whatever. Alright, let me just keep going. Quit fucking around. That you guys didn't come here to listen to me talk about that. You came here to watch me play this goddamn game. Isn't that right? Uh there's a lot of ocean. That's uh yeah. yeah. Where, where are you going, you asshole? God! <laughs> I can just hear it now. Hmm. Very busy. Busy, uh... Yeah, been busy, busy, busy week for me. Preparing for, preparing for a little giveaway I'm doing actually. Uh, for those of you who follow my Facebook Red Gun Show, or I should say the Red Gun Show Facebook page, uh, I'm doing a little, little giveaway right now. I'm still, uh, I'm gonna wait, you know, to get the word out there. I'm not just gonna do it and then oh, a couple days later, here you go. That's it. Fuck you. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna promote it a little bit, you know. It's nothing major, just a Sega 2, a, a, a Sega Genesis, uh, Sega Genesis 2. It works, trust me, it's not just, oh, it doesn't work, I'm gonna give it a no. It works, it's fine. But I have an extra one. Or that's my extra one, so I'm just, instead of just selling it or whatever on eBay or what have you, I'm just, I'm just gonna give it away. So there you go. And, uh, sweepstakes information is... Still to come, very shortly. By the time I get this video uploaded, uh, it'll probably the announcement for the further details will be a few days from that. If not, this website, uh, the uh, little the, the giveaway itself. So there you go. Really, it's just a ploy to get likes on Facebook and, uh, and YouTube. But fuck, whatever. <laughs> That's the price I gotta pay. Uh, no, it, I I enjoy giving stuff away. You know, I enjoy making people happy. That's why I'm an entertainer. Boom, Matoya's cave, right? Mm hmm. Is it Matoya's cave? Yes. La 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 la. -da. She's a bitch out. There she is. All right. I don't know why I went to the top. Whatever. Wondrous potion. Yay, and then I go back to where I just was and wake up that damn prince or whatever. I can see everything. <laughs> and uh, we'll get this game on the road. It's like, last time I uh, last time I was recording and playing this, I was uh, I didn't want to stop, but it was real hella late at night. And I, I do have a, a job, you know, outside of the Red Gun Show. Uh, and for those of you who, who don't know, <clears throat> excuse me, or the, for those of you who are new to Red Gun Show, it's a Let's Play channel. I will be branching out to other forms of media, 
but uh, starting off, it's a red, it's a let's play challenge. It's so they're, let's be realistic, they're easy to make. <laughs> they're easy to edit. <coughs> they're easy. They're easier to edit if you're if you keep it simple, which that's what I do. Uh, it's myself and my co-host Steven half the time. We have to work around our schedules, and that's why there are times that I I solo it. And this is one of my solo games. But, we do what we can. I personally like, uh, I, I always watch the full, the full videos after each recording for quality control. If there's something about it I don't like, I, I just won't use it. And yes, I have, you know, been in that situation where I've recorded an hour or so of footage and, uh, I have not used it. I won't say which game. But it has happened, and it's it's like a punch in the face. It really is when that kind of shit happens. But it's unavoidable, and it's not going to stop me from doing that project again. So there you go. Yeah, I like the energy of working with somebody. I definitely do. But anyway, it's taking me a little longer in this game than probably what it should. Mostly because normally I have a strategy guide in front of me. Just, just so I can know where to go and what the recommended levels are, but I'm, uh, I'm just doing this pretty much off of memory, so we'll, uh, we'll see how long it actually takes me. I said before, it's probably uh, it's if you if you do just one straight way through, you, you probably have about nine hours, eight or nine hours, just casually, you know. I'm sure you can shorten that at least to at least half that, if not. If not, like, a lot more. Or a quarter or an eighth or anything. If, uh, if you go speed, if, if you if you figure out the mechanics of the game, and to, uh, if you're into that kind of stuff with speed running, you know, you can definitely do that. I know you can. They're all pretty much set up like that. And I'll go ahead and just fire to it again. No biggie. It's like, I'm, I still, I, I know I've talked about this in a previous uh, session for this game, but man, I, I still remember that day I got that, that Final Fantasy cartridge for the NES. Man, that was, that was a hell of a day. I, th I thought I was king shit for that. I really did. And honestly, one of the hardest games that I've, I've ever played. Most definitely. The, uh... The cave that I just finished, I was never able to actually finish it in the NES cartridge. It was, it was, I, I, were, I gave up. I'm not gonna say it was too hard. I just, I gave up. You know, it was, it was so hard just to get it because you can only have nine magic for each level. You see how it's right now. I have 26, 23, 16, and 11 as the max levels, or the the, the max usages for these. Uh, for each magic level, respectively, or whatnot. But in the NES version, you can only have nine of each. And you run out of cures fast, unless you have two white mages, but that's just not practical. Uh, you can always have a red mage, but I, honestly, I don't, I don't recommend them. That's why I'm not using one. That's why I started with one and decided to start over. Even though this is the part I am using is a little more challenging. I'll, I'll figure it out. Yeah, it's glad I have it. It's in my, you know, I, I still have it. I'll always have it as, as much as I can control that. And if there's ever for all the for all the people that that uh, I'm lucky enough to have watch my my stuff, if there's ever a uh, if there's ever a video game that you the viewer would like to see, would like to recommend, just say something in the comments. You can say something in the comments of my Facebook Red Gun Show page, or say something in the comments in, right here on YouTube. I am a YouTube partner, so this will be exclusively on YouTube. I will only do my Let's Plays on YouTube, so this is where that's, you know, 
keep keep coming here. That's where you can find me. Chances there's a good chance that uh, I just might actually have the game that you would try to recommend. If not, if I'm feeling it, I might feel kind of swirly and just uh, go ahead and get the game too. Who knows? Because as of right now, I I have said many times I have a lot of games in storage, a lot. But in in house, I have uh, it's. Yes, it's over 600 games now. 620 is what my board says. If you can believe that or not, I have, you know, I have plenty of room. I need to always try and do a little re re rearranging, a little reorganizing for all my stuff, make it look a little more neat, a little more pretty. But on we go. On we go to, to Prince mode. No, yeah, I believe I have to. I'm just going to double check. I think I have to go to the castle that's in that grotto area. But I'm just going to make sure. Because I think this is where I fought that, that boss. Is that correct? Let's triple check. Oh, no. It is here I'm supposed to come. Wow, I came here. Shit. <laughs> Damn. There we go, the Jolt Tonic. Yay, it awakens the prince. Yes! We must try it out once! Let's do it. Oh, he woke up. Look at that. <laughs> I wonder what that's like to be in a coma. That that must be crazy. Like, I don't mean physically. I mean, like, in your, in your mind, do you dream? How often do you dream? Is it a... Or daydreaming. Are you conscious? Are you aware of what's going on around you? I know there's different stages of comas or different types of comas, I should say. But uh, that's something I, I wonder. Should have been a psych major. Should have been a surgeon. Oh wow. Now I go to the grotto. Okay. Right? Yeah. See if I'm right. <laughs> I gotta go south. Okay. <laughs> we. East and then south. Uh, or is it north? Eh, I'll find out. <laughs> Figure it out. Yes, this is just a casual play. You know, I'm not gonna press myself for time. Or if I make a mistake, I'm not gonna edit it out or anything like that. I'm just gonna have fun doing this. I, uh. For those, for those movie buffs out there, um, if you are a movie buff, then most likely, oh I'm sorry, I should say a, a movie aficionado, if you are such a person, you you may or may not have seen a movie called Citizen Kane, made by Orson Welles. It's a very rich history, uh, but in that movie, he, uh, the, the, the title character, Mr. Charles Foster Kane, played by Orson Welles, um, has a declaration of principles that he writes out. And uh, one of the that was actually one of the first things I thought of when I was when I was doing the concept for this for this project. I'll call my YouTube channel my project. When I was doing the concept for this project, that's what I had in mind. So you, you have to not rules, but you just have to have like a format, things you're gonna follow, or whatnot. I try to have quality. I I, I know that I don't always. Uh, there's other than me just being a, a lazy asshat. The only other reason I don't edit more, or more efficiently, or more effectively, I should say, like microphone drops and stuff like that. It, it, nothing's perfect, you know. Uh, sometimes I forget. Sometimes I don't. I know that uh, in one of my Star Fox videos, I left I left a microphone drop in there. It's probably about 20 seconds long, but eh, it's alright. Whatever. Yeah, I know. I know. If, if you know me personally, you, this is this is one of the only things I ever talk about. This this uh, this pro is is my project. You know, 
uh, I'm always, I'm, I'm always promising, oh, I swear to God, man, um, I, I have to have high quality, I really do. But no, that's true, I, I, I do strive for the best. But at the same time, I fully, I fully appreciate humility. It's something everybody should, should experience in life, some, some form of humility. I learned from it, you should learn from it as well. You probably do. Uh, yeah. Started, uh, started watching something that I haven't watched since I was a teenager again. Started to watch Neon Genesis Evangelion again. I, uh, I first got that series when I was about 15 years old. Yeah, it was. I got it for one Christmas. I ended up buying a toy for it. I was at a local mall one time and I, I spotted a toy and I. I you know, I didn't recognize what it was from, so I was looking at it. My mom asked me, did you want it? I'm like, yeah, sure. Let's do this. So I took it. Or, uh, you know, it was, it was purchased. Damn, paralyzed. Right. It was purchased. I had no idea what it was. I knew it was a very high-quality toy, because at that point in my life, I was collecting... Um, I was collecting action figures, you know, like spawn action figures and things like that. Yeah, it was mostly was just spawn and Todd McFarlane and stuff. Yep, it's fine. Anyway, um, so I, I I went on the internet and I looked it up, and uh, I found one of the pages I found. Shit, that's not where I want to go. I don't think it is. One of the uh, damn. One of the places, or well, one of the websites that I found was, uh, it was like a synopsis. So... It was a, I'm sorry, it was a synopsis, sorry, I got a little, a little distracted, I have a lot going on right now in, in my recording room. It was a synopsis, it was a episode-by-episode-by-episode episode episode synopsis. 